Hi everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is Firoz Mohammed here. So in this video, I'm just going to talk about one of the latest Dynamics Fire certification, which is MB200, Dynamics Fire Customer Engagement Core. So here you can just see the content of this particular exam. This is one of the latest exams, which is part of your functional consultant certifications. I'll talk about the Dynamics Fire learning path separately. And also I have another video on MB210. So both MB200 and 210 together calls you the Dynamics 5 Sales Functional Consultant Certification. That is one of the role-based certification that Microsoft has launched recently. So I'm just preparing for these exams and also I'm just shooting a video course on MB200 as well as on 210. So once I finish these courses, I'll be launching these courses on Udemy as well as on my own website which is www.dynamicsfiacademy.com. So I'll keep, I'll keep you updating as I just progress with my study. So in this particular video, I'm just going to talk about the complete syllabus of MB200 Dynamics 5 for Customer Engagement Core Certification Exam. So let's get started. So there are six modules in this one. I'll, I'll just go through each of this one. So I have written an article also on this one, on my own blog. So under MB200, it is judging a lot of skill of yours from Dynamics 5 sales as well as from the core management. First of all, perform discovery planning and analysis that covers different areas like how to understand out of the box functionality of one of your CRM requirement. And also come up with a proof of concept for one of the requirement. And then perform an auditing and then identify the comments of the entities, etc. The next one is manage user experience design, that is checking your skills on areas like configuring dashboards, forms, chart, report, views, etc. And then also is talking about creating email, Excel, and Word template for Dynamics 5. And then managing process that include configuring a business flow, business process flow, workflow, etc. Now, in the second module, which I just explained, some of the areas are mapping with MB210 as well. That is, MB210 means Dynamics 5 for sales. So some of those areas are already overlapping. Then comes manage entities and data. That also I can see there is a lot of mapping with MB210, which is checking your knowledge on existing data models, such as creating or modifying the existing entity, relationship, fields, and etc. And also importing data into Dynamics 5 data import wizard. And then creating template for Dynamics 5, perform field mapping, and also performing duplicate detection as well as bulk record deletion from Dynamics 5. Then we are talking about the security part, which is covering areas like managed security roles, managing users, teams, field level security profile, etc. Then comes implementing the integration part, that really checking uh, skills on two areas. One is configuring Outlook to Dynamics 5, and second one is configuring the email with Dynamics 5, as well as integrating Dynamics 5 with Office 365, including one mode, one ray for business and SharePoint. And finally, the last session is perform solution deployment as well as testing that is covering skills on like managing the application using Dynamics 5 administration portal, as well as managing your solutions like creating, updating, deploying solutions. Also performing system admin tasks like Creating connection roles, currency is subject, then audit settings, quick find, configure session, etc. So yeah, these are the six modules which is being tested on MB200 certificate exams. I, as you can see that there are a lot of places where we have overlap with MB210 as well. That means if you're just preparing for both of this, then a lot of areas are covered together. So you can take advantage of that one. I hope this video was very useful to you guys. If you have any question, you can just comment that in the comment box. I'll be happy to answer. So thanks for watching. Have a great day.